Girl, you're lucky I'm strong as fuck right now and on antidepressants. <laughs> if you even care to look me up before posting your video, you would see that I'm a YouTuber like yourself and I had recently just posted on this channel a video that I am trying to overcome depression. Something you like to speak about too a lot, right? So what are you doing bullying and bringing down young women on a platform with 11 million subscribers? Is that how you're gonna use your voice? Is that what you're trying to do with your platform? Or are you gonna use my face for views? Like seriously, what's up with that? My face is so much bigger than yours on your own thumbnail. Let's be real. Like I'd say my picture takes up the entire thumbnail and then there's like a sliver of your face in the little corner. I could actually come after you legally cause you didn't ask me for permission, but you know what? I'm better than that. I don't need your money. I'm not trying to come after you. You messaged me an apology on Instagram way after you uploaded the video after realizing who the fuck I was and who I am and that I'm a YouTuber as well. But the thing is, is my face is still on your video. It's humiliating. And if you're gonna use my face for views, then I'm going to respond to your messages in a video format for views as well. Now, I'm not gonna go off and tell you how to live or how I think of you like you did to me and other girls and a 12 year old, but rather I'm gonna sit here and maturely tell you that I do not agree with your video. No matter what way you want the video to be perceived and no matter what way you intended the video to be, I felt very belittled, mocked, and more so humiliated. As a content creator like yourself, it felt very discrediting to my years of work just to be slapped on a YouTube thumbnail as the girl who wants to be Ariana Grande so bad, not the girl who's been posting content for years and years and years of her life and dedicating her entire time and energy into creating content for my viewers. But you should understand that, right? I mean, you're Sniper Wolf. I've been watching you for years. I did not work all these years just to be slapped on your video and referred to as that. That's not fair. This video did trigger me and so did your messages to me. It was like those girls in high school. I mean, you probably get it, you're 26. You remember Facebook. When people would leave video messages on each other's Facebook walls. Well, when I was in high school, the mean girls, the bullies, they would leave videos on each other's walls mocking me. But whenever I'd get upset about it, they'd say, oh no, it's okay, it was just meant to be funny. Well, it might be funny to you, but it's not funny to the person that it's about, you know? No matter what the intention was, that was bullying. And for someone who speaks so strongly about mental health, that's fucked up. Don't bring people down just because you don't agree with what they're doing to themselves. And yeah, I'm sure a lot of people agree with the things you said in that video, and even if there's validity and truth to it, it's not your place to bring attention to that, call attention to that, and put all these girls in this negative light on such a large platform. One of the girls is 12 years old, come on. Imagine, imagine her going to school at that age and everyone saying, oh, I just saw you on Sniper Wolf's video. And imagine the bullying she's gonna get in school that's gonna follow her outside of online. And every clip you showed of me in that video was from years ago, and believe it or not, all seven years I've been on YouTube, I've had the same voice. I've loved your videos for years. My brother thinks you're hot, my boyfriend thinks you're hot, I even think you're hot. But I don't agree with your video. I'm embarrassed. I feel bullied. Do you feel like this wasn't fair and it was honestly quite random, so I don't understand the intention of it? This doesn't mean I don't like you. And speaking on behalf of Ariana Grande, it ain't Ariana Grande, that ain't it. All right, peace.